Tonight, the Copernicus Sentinel-1C takes off from Europe's spaceport aboard Vega C, a significant step forward in the Copernicus program, an EU initiative dedicated to monitoring our planet, its climate and environment. The Sentinel satellites are part of Copernicus, the Earth observation component of the EU space program. Copernicus is managed by the European Commission and is funded by the EU with a partial contribution of the European Space Agency, ESA. The Sentinel-1 mission highlights the strong partnership between the European Space Agency and the European Union to provide vital radar data that Europe relies on. Built by Thales Alenia Space, Sentinel-1C is part of the Sentinel-1 satellite family designed to capture high-resolution imagery of the Earth's surface day and night and in all weather conditions. Ever since Sentinel-1A was launched back in 2014, the mission has provided crucial information helping to monitor land deformation, earthquake areas, volcanic activity, deforestation, glacial movements, sea ice and oil spills. Beyond these applications, Sentinel-1C will also play a vital role in maritime safety as it is equipped with an AIS antenna to better monitor the movement of ships in critical maritime zones. The satellite also features a Galileo-enabled receiver for more precise orbit determination. Sentinel-1C's consistent data will benefit various sectors by supporting responses to climate-related challenges and enabling sustainable resource management. By adding Sentinel-1C to the fleet, the Copernicus program ensures continuity in its mission. Just like all Copernicus data, the data from Sentinel-1C is open and free to users worldwide, supporting environmental scientists, policymakers, and organizations working to protect ecosystems and ensure a sustainable future. The launch of Sentinel-1C on Vega C enhances the Copernicus program and underscores the EU's dedication to global sustainability and technological progress in space. <laughs>